Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Let's jump right into it. In today's video you will find out how the price of IOTA has changed and what the technical indicators RSI, Stochastic RSI and MACD are showing. If you are not familiar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos down below in the description. By taking a closer look at the hourly time frame for IOTA, the price went down only slight by about 1.6% in the last 24 hours and has a current price of 70.0 cents. Moving to the hourly relative strength index, the current hourly RSI is at 43, so it doesn't show signs of overbought or oversold conditions at this point. Moving to the hourly stochastic RSI, the crypto is being oversold because both the percent %K and percent %D lines are currently very low. This means that we can expect a change in the trend or for the crypto can remain at least stable for some time. However, the K line still hasn't crossed the D line, so you should wait to see if the trend will actually change to the upside. Looking at the hourly MACD, the trend is currently going down because the MACD line is below the signal line. The MACD histogram shows that the momentum is currently strong and it could be expected the price to go further to the downside. Jumping to the 3 hourly relative strength index, the current 3 hourly RSI is at 47, so it doesn't show signs of overbought or oversold conditions at this point. Jumping to the 3 hourly stochastic RSI, the stochastic RSI currently shows no overbought or oversold conditions, but the percent %K line is below the percent %D line, which means the current trend is on the downside. Moving to the 3 hourly MACD, seeing as the MACD line is above the signal line, meaning that the trend is currently on the up. However, the MACD histogram shows that the momentum is currently shifting to the downside and it could be expected that the price will consolidate and it is better to wait and see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be bearish. In general, the larger time frames have a greater impact on the price, so please remember that when we display different time frames with different indicators. And also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short-term trading. Thanks for watching. New videos are uploaded every few hours analyzing various cryptocurrencies, so be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out. If there is something that you didn't understand, leave us a comment below and we'll get back to you. You should know that trading with cryptocurrencies is very risky and these videos are only an overview of what happens with the price and a pure technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. So you should read more and make your own investing decisions. See you next time time.